All right, you beautiful bastards. Welcome to, uh, for me at least, the final Spider-Man video for a while as I uh, steam through Hogwarts Legacy. So, uh, yeah. It's going to be a bit rough when I come back. I mean, can't be get into the thick of it and then freaking take, like, who knows, a freaking two-month break or whatever. And then come back and be right where you left off. Yuri, this construction site's about as legit as the watches they sell in Times Square. I don't have evidence for a warrant. You go in, you're on your own. What else is new? Just had to be Spider-Man. Just had to be. Come on, hit me. Come on, hit me. Stop it. Come on, hit me. I'm in an ass kicking mood. Why are none of you hitting me? Come on. There's freaking four of you. And none of you are attacking. Now there's three. Don't worry. I got plenty of face kicks left. Come on, hit me. Okay, fine. Now you can hit me. Couldn't hit me up there for some reason. Stop it! Come on, you hit uh, Okay, okay, you hit me. That's good. That's good for you. Okay. We're all proud of you. Okay, thank you. Now you can all die. Really? More guys? I don't have this many friends. Get back at you. I checked records and that site's been getting deliveries from cartel front companies. They're moving drugs, huh? Not for long. Keep him on the ground. Ooh. Oh, great, more of them. Guys, this isn't here. You could have just bailed. Look out. Come on, bring them down already. Sorry, uh, was that an RPG? the joke. Actually, I have a 
I actually have a suit that gives me a bulletproof power. Semi bulletproof. Stop it. Oh, <clears throat> I can't see the cool freaking slow mo. Is that a freaking rocket launcher again? My god. From the part where the rocket hits me, what is <laughs> freaking whatever? I got a bunch of incapacitated <laughs> criminals and designer narcotics all wrapped up and waiting for you. Great, I'll just consider this an anonymous tip. How many more fist construction sites are there? None. He had every one of them working overtime to bring in money. Well, now he's gonna have a tough time keeping his operation running, which is bad for Fisk and good for New York. I trust you. Yourself. Willie, funny story. I was just at one of your buildings, and you'd be shocked to hear that there were shenanigans of the criminal variety. Uh -huh. Damn, DR, fist construction is closed. I have other sources of revenue, but you've inconvenienced me, and there will be consequences. My memory's long, my reach is longer. I should make all the guys who've sworn to kill me fight it out for the privilege. You know, it also reminds me, um, new suit, new suit, can't do that one, even though I want to get that one out of the way, because I don't want to look at it, so oh, what's this, alright, hmm, huh, I'll do Secret Wars, why not, oh, and then, <laughs> we have this, I love the thought that nothing can be a world wor could be a world record unless excuse me, sir, everyone in the world gives it a try. I think we read that again. MJ Watson Jackpot. I love your article. You're the only one showing NYC the real truth. I think that was the duplicate as well. The smell emanating from my neighbor's room sounds like you open can get food and say, yeah, okay, okay. Halloween party meetup at new location message for details. Regulars only. Nope, not sketchy at all. This post has been deleted. On TV, yes, camera. I will make sure your needs are taken care of. Ignores all surrounding humans. Check your doors and fire escapes. Demons are busting onto roofs, laying traps for NYC wall crawler. Keep him safe. I think we read that as well. Just landed a job at the coffee bean. Your girl's getting back on her feet. Big thanks to May at Feast for helping me with the application. Oh, Gloria. Good for you. The hashtag ESU Halloween party isn't just for the kids. I've been working on a costume for months. Can't wait to show it off. Got to see a shirtless man. Okay, we read that one. Excuse me? Just sounds like there's freaking a crime or something. Felicia's close to her goal. I've got to put an end to this, and fast. This area is full of Wall Street guys. Target rich environment. Hmm. No. No. Hmm.
Mm -hmm. Come on, where is it? Where is it? I just saw someone walk past that window. Did you see it? It's right there. Red circle. There you are. She's obviously familiar with these places. And that gives me an idea how to catch her. Is that a pigeon? And a kawaii? I'm JJ, of course. Bring your children into the room, friends, because <sighs> you're delivering a lesson impressionable uh -huh. youngsters need to hear. My guest today is a man who learned the hard way that dressing up like Spider-Man isn't cool. Go ahead, sir. Well, I, I learned to fight crime and help people, and I'm a big Spider-Man fan, so I put on a costume like his and try to do what he does. Boy, was that a mistake. I almost got killed. I'm just lucky the real Spider-Man saved me. Let me stop you right there, because I think the salient point has been made. Emulate Spider-Man in any way, and you will die! Don't do it, kids! And that's another one of Uncle Jonah's life lessons. Jared, trademark that! Well, I do like you get little exclusive things. <laughs> if you uh, do side missions. Makes the world feel real. Oh, I got sneeze. I think this is not gonna be good. No, wait, no. I think it's gone. Along with this guy. Ooh. Ooh. Fight like men possessed. Jesus. Oh, Friar's Coffee. I found it. Bad mojo, officer. Real bad. Mojo? Spider Man, have you been watching Austin Powell? Oh, baby. Alert. Can't. Come on. It's a fast one. They're all pretty fast, Peter. I mean, Spider Man. Okay. What we got here? From old Otto Octavius himself, or Octavius Industries. Hey, Doctor. Hello, Peter. I'll be just a minute. Wow. Look at all this new stuff. How did he get all of this? Suspicious. Very suspicious. That's the raft. Uh, Peter... Isn't this kind of alarming? Why does your uh, scientist friend here have a picture of the raft with exactly, like, the cost of... What do what you say? Upgrades? I don't know. That's a bit weird. A bit finicky. Hmm. Something's a little weird here. I didn't want to say it. <laughs> oh. Running tests on carbon nanotube biocompatibility. Uh, huh. Huh. 
Hmm. It's always on this big friggin' thing here. I would go there. Oh, triple? No. Okay. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Hmm. So this one could be like a subtract. That one could go there. Nope. No, no, no. Because, like, this is too perfect. This is where now it starts to pluck my brain. Real good. Never mind, I'm a genius. And that genius is <coughs> name is uh, decent candidate for a direct tissue interface, but I feel like we can do better. A die five full trial uh Oslum Romite. Yeah. Die file whatever. Next one. Hmm. Graphene, but the structure is super unique. What is this? Tell you what this is. That one. Guess what? That one. With a little bit of that one. Mixed with not that one. Hmm. Maybe if we put is it? Come bam. So smart. So smart and so smart. Yes. Graphene. Awesome. And nano lice. It's been nano latticed. Nano lattice. Wow, that's strong. Could be a great structural element for a prosthetic. <coughs> that's exactly what I said. I don't know why my throat is so itchy all of a sudden. Doc's messing around with superconductors. Ha 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 I'm so smart. I'm so smart. Smart, smart, smart. Little did I know that's not the correct one. Hmm. Mm hmm. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay. Nope. Probably is the wrong one, actually. Hmm. One there. Okay, 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 but... We got something. We got something. Oh my god. So smart. Leds. Very cool. Lezer, kinda... Complex oxide ceramic. Perfect type 2 superconductor. Exactly. It'll run hot. 
but maybe good for an outboard controller? What is this next glorious one? Huh? Some kind of polymer. 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 Hmm. So we need to double that up. Then we're gonna do with that. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. No, that doesn't work. Get stupid. What if we do that? No, that's even worse. Ah. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> you need that one. No, no. I'm not smart anymore. I'm a Dumbo. No offense, Dumbo, but you know. So you know, this one can't go here. So we would need to use that one to get rid of the middle one, and that's three. There's only two that can get rid of the middle, and I would both then leave with that. So that one does not go there. These are three. Ah, 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 boop. Boop. Okay, okay, okay. Getting some off the board is progress. And progress is very important. Progress. Well, then I guess this wouldn't matter since I need three and there it be. Bow! Oh. <clears throat> so smart. Just had to find the right order. A poly... Methyl map. This stuff will survive almost Quick. anything. Look. Yeah. Okay. Parker, we've been focused on limb replacement, connecting nerves at severed extremities, replicating the function of lost appendages. But what if instead we gave people something they've never seen? Something. Straight from the mind. Unchain all of us from the bodies we've been born with, and instead, unleash the awesome power of our minds. Mm. Okay. In some sad, sick way, the City Hall attack may have done some good. Norman's approval ratings are sinking. The people are starting to realize their beloved mayor only cares about himself. Sometimes it takes a tragedy to wake people up to the truth, to finally see the monster they themselves elected. Wish Doc wouldn't fixate on Norman like this. Hmm. Interesting method of structural reinforcement. Mm. Oh, no signs here. And how could it be so callous? Music. 
lots of late nights in this lab. Yes, cheese squares, we know it. We know it, Pierre. We know it. Ah, you said it. Anything? Nothing, okay. I'll just check my room first. Really glad Doc let me store things here after the whole eviction thing. Oh, Peter! Huh? I noticed you keep track of Spider-Man's foes. Smart. Easier to craft countermeasures that way. Vulture might be the smartest guy up on this wall. Not smart enough to duck three consecutive life sentences, of course, but still pretty brainy. A vulture is squawks. Tombs claims frame up. Blames moral crawler. Mob enforcer turned walking tank. Rhino's racked up enough property damage to destroy Manhattan three times over. Rhino's rampage road blocked. Fisk opens our gallery. Taxi strike begins. ESU campus expansion complete. And then where's this one? Octavius Industries are in city grant. Elections. Fisk Tower construction. Okay. Gonna miss that humorless grimace. Fisk, Crusader or Criminal. Oscorp posts Q4 earnings. Damage control. Fisk buys a shoreline property. Huh. Electro was the first legit super powered villain I fought. Till then it had been regular guys in fancy suits. Electro was a big change. Electro. Change. Electro unplugged. Go inside his sci-fi cell in the raft. Scientific breakthroughs. Osborne, better big apple. New attorney general. Last time I fought Scorpion, he asked if I knew what my skull looked like from the inside. Then offered to show me. Super fun guy. Jesus, can barely see this one. Will Scorpion sing or sting? Trial begins tomorrow. A corruption case. Conviction. Sanitation strike. Is that what it says? Television ratings plummet. Now, I'm no good at math. But there's five here. Then you got Martin. And yet, Dr. Octopus. <clears throat> that makes seven. Oh, obviously, it can't be the Sinister Six then. If there's seven. What the hell? Doc, why are you doing this? Octavius Industries, groundbreaking technology, creating the world you desire. Then he's just going through logos. That that's just Green Lantern right there. Okay. Onward to story. Get all this equipment. Called in every last favor. Aim. Loans. It's like we're starting over once again. But this time's going to be different. This is, this is Aang, Aldridge Killian? The Mandarin? You've been busy. Just getting started. You know, until now, we've been looking at prosthetics from the wrong perspective. Why restore people to what they were when we can make them better? Okay, I think that should do it. Bro. Well. Ready? <laughs> Everything okay? Damn it! 
This is all your fault, Norman, you son of a... Well, I know who you're not voting for in the next election. Sorry. I uh, have a habit of making bad jokes in tense situations. <laughs> uh, it was a good joke, Parker. Just a bit of an overreaction on my part. No, don't worry. Uh, why don't you take a break? I'll, uh, I'll clean this up and uh, get us ready for another test. So, uh, hope you don't mind me asking, but it seems you and Norman have a bit of a history. We were lab partners in college. Became friends. Decided to start a business. We both had visions of changing the world just in different ways. Wait, you were at Oscorp when it started? I'm half the reason it's called Oscorp. In grad school, everyone called us the O's. <sighs> Add Corp to that and, well, it is a catchy name. Well, why'd you leave? Norman became more and more obsessed with genetics. He started a project I considered unethical. And there was this... Anyway, lawyers got involved. I chose to leave in exchange for a settlement. But that money didn't last very long. I've relied on grants ever since. If this project doesn't work... Don't worry. It'll work. Uh, let, me, let me just fix this up. I'll brew some fresh coffee. He's wearing his classic green turtleneck. Be sure to run a diagnostic on the control unit. Could be a short. Definitely a sign. Huh. Ah. No good. Gotta reroute this circuit. What is this? You were off by one. So, gotta reroute it this way. Because he had to, like, permanently attach these. We don't need these. I'll take those off your hands. Since you can't do it yourself, apparently. What do we got? We got four and three. Hmm. So it needs to be five. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, easy, easy. Just had to do some quick maths. And then we want the three to then wire right here, right here. Boom. <coughs> oh, no, I made the same catastrophic error. Whoops. I thought it, I thought it was six, too. God damn it. I'm a failure. Oh, why don't you do the honors this time? We did it. Next step, neural interface. That's a lot of work for you to do by yourself. You sure you can handle it? Apparently not, judging by today's debacle. Because I still haven't found another job. My funds are still... I know. It's okay. Don't worry, I'll figure it out. What's a few bucks when you're trying to change the world, right? To changing the world. Call from MJ. Doctor, I need to go, but I'll be back later. Don't worry, the work will still be here when you get back. Neural interface would be a big step, Doc. Big, yes, but essential. If our prosthesis is anything less than effortless to use, we'll have failed. We'll get there, Peter. 
We have to. You know, the micro cables we use to simulate musculature could easily be arranged into simple shapes. Wrenches, hammers, a toolbox literally at your fingertips. Mm. Don't know if I'm comfortable with some of these funding sources. All science is built on risk. Better to embrace it than run from it. Okay. Why can I talk to you freely? Freaking triggering all your dialogue stuff, but then with that, Aunt May, I have to walk out of the room and then come back. Doc really does want to imagine a better version of man. Mm, yes. That old classic picture. Advanced idea mechanics. Doc, are you sure it's a good idea to accept grants from AIM? Their rep is pretty shady. Beggars can't be choosers, Peter. Once we're on our feet, we'll reevaluate our funding partners. Yeah, you keep kind of pushing off everything. Oh, yeah, no, that's just what I already listened to. Unless there's another one on it. In some sad, sick way, nope. the city hall attack may have done them. Ah, uh, nothing. Why did you allow me to do it then? What's that? What? What's what? Can't just say that, Peter. What's what? Oh. What is this stuff, Doc? Looks like armored plating. Defense prototypes. Fascinating, really. Aim has requested a number of samples of my work. Who am I to deny that my genius? Ah. Kidding, of course. <clears throat> Doc's working on some kind of advanced hypodermic delivery system. Maybe to help with implant rejection? I don't know, that's a big needle. Wait, is this the raft? Are you doing work for the Supermax prison? Indeed. They're soliciting bids to modernize their security grid. Figured I'd try my hand. Lucrative contract, and a satisfyingly difficult nut to crack. Mm, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I guess it, I mean, this is all suspicious, right? I only know that, you know, the plating and stuff is a little nod to what's to come. But then it's like, he's making all this up. Huh. Is that, is that what happened? Because I don't know the full scope of it, but like, you think he got the money from Martin Lee, and then he bought all this stuff, and then they're going to break out freaking Electro, Rhino, Scorpion, and all that from the raft. And that's why he's worried that if his, uh, this doesn't pull through, he won't be able to do it, and then he's going to have freaking gangs uh, knock at his door. Yeah, okay, just checking. It's all coming together. A lot of uh, power you're routing. Elect electric bill is going to be something. Hey, sorry I missed your call. We still on for dinner? Dinner? Oh, yeah. I was calling you about something else, but yeah, we should talk over dinner. Offer still stands for me to come over and cook. Oh, really? Well, I like to take risks. I'm still out, but I'll grab some stuff at the store and let you know when I'm home. Okay, talk soon. All right, dinner at MJ's. No expectations. It'll be hard to screw this one up. Well, I guess I'll just freelance for a while until she calls. You have a beer, Peter? <laughs> because you're about to make her hold it or whatever. Yeah. He's going to find a way to screw it up. Guaranteed. 100%. But, uh, yeah. I'm going to use this suit in the next episode, seeing that this was a very heavy, uh, puzzle, friggin' <laughs> progressing, friggin' the Peter storyline more than Spider-Man. Plus, I've got to change it in the beginning, so, uh, you know. Whatever. But, anywho... Some very big developments, very uh, suspicious uh, things going on with Otto. 
and Triple J. Remember that barbaric beast named the Rhino? Apparently last night he almost escaped from his cell in the raft. How, you ask? Well, no one there seems to know, but they assure me he's been relocated to a more secure cell. Now, I'm no expert on Supermax prisons, but isn't the whole point of them that there isn't anything else more secure? I mean, he's a 700-pound maniac with an indestructible horn. If there's a more secure cell, why wasn't he in it? Calm down, Jonah. And let me do my outro. Freaking hell. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I'm trying to do it with some story. Not like it really matters because freaking it's like this series will never go away. For you, it hasn't stopped. For me, once again, it's gonna be probably a little bit of a break. I'm gonna finish these three bundles and then uh delete the game and uh free up space for Hogwarts to just record so much. But yeah. We'll see how that goes. But anywho, I hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you in the next one. You beautiful bastards. Bye-bye.